All right, guys, we are gonna game stream with the NVIDIA Force GeForce Now service on the new 2019 NVIDIA Shield. And just to let you know my setup, I have my router, which is in my bedroom, and that is about, I don't know, 60 feet away from the room that I'm in now. That door is actually closed. And then also I have my uh, door closed in my office. So you can see it's gonna go through a couple of things. This game auto saves. Um, and let's do continue without saving. Continue without, are you wish to continue without loading? Uh, say yeah, continue without loading. Okay. And we will just jump into a career game right here. Just to show you how well this stuff runs. And again, if, you're gonna get more optimal service if you plug this directly into your router or you're closer to the router and you're going on Wi-Fi. But just to show you, this stuff is gonna work well no matter which version of the system you choose. And you'll still be able to play very high-end um, games on here. So, that's, you know, cool stuff. Uh, why don't we be, well, I guess I'm her, I chose her by accident. You see, loading time's pretty damn fast on this too. I'm not even really skipping ahead of anything. Hopefully I play this game, I'm assuming it's right trigger. There we go. And I'm using the official NVIDIA controller on here, so you might hear some um, oh no, and I don't really know how to play this game either, so if I awful at this, that's why. But so far, this thing is running awesome. I'm using a TP-Link AX6000 router. I've done a review on it, and I absolutely love it. It's got great range, great power, great um, speed on there, it's awesome. And you can see it's running this, uh, it's running this perfectly fine as well. Ooh, ooh. And we'll jump into some other games too. This is this will not be the only game I try on here. Just in case you can you're you're thinking that uh, I'm not going to try anything good. We'll also put on Fortnite as well. But so far so good. I mean, you can see there's no lag on this or anything. The graphics look decent, better than decent. They look really good. So to be able to stream your your game library on here and. Uh, not have to have a really high powered gaming system and spend thousands of dollars on a PC that this is excellent. And you can do this with the 27. This is what I'm doing now. Don't get me wrong. It's not something you couldn't do previously. I just wanted to really show off the regular Nvidia shield, you know, in case you didn't want to spend uh, the extra 50 bucks to get the, the more expensive one. Ooh, 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 first place, baby. Not too bad. And I, I haven't seen any lag or anything. Everything seems to be running at a higher frame rate. And this is definitely one of the best uh, kart racing games. Final lap, final lap. Can we do it, guys? Can we do, ooh, ooh, oh my gosh, oh my God. The water, a little bit harder to navigate. Oh, come on. Am I going the right way? I'm going backwards, what's going on here? I don't know, why am I going the wrong way? No, I'm in second now, dang. Oh, come on. Oh my God. I feel like I'm lost. There we go. Turn, 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 turn. Oh, he took a shortcut. Come on. I think he's gonna get it. Oh, come on. I'm not sure how to use my power-ups. Oh, the, okay, A, A, A. Dang. Oh, 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 we're back on land. These laps are long. Oh, wait, can I get him? Shoot him. Oh, I don't have any bullets left. Dang, second place. Not bad, though. Let's try the next game. So far, you saw that ran amazing. All right, guys, next game up is PUBG. Again, this is game streaming from the GE Force Now servers. I, um, it's a little bit later in the day now because this game was patching earlier. That's one of the things with these games is they seem to patch a while. Like Fortnite at this time, which is almost, I don't know, at least 12 hours later is still patching. So that's one of the, again, one of the negatives about this. When they have to patch a game, it takes a little bit while. Um, so far, I've seen a couple of not hiccups, but you can see it's not completely smooth. I'm also, again, not right next to my router. The same setup as before. Two doors closed a little later in the day. So... There's probably a, little, a few more people online right now. 
X. I gotta equip this. Why right, isn't that working? So the controls are a little bit. I guess it's using the keyboard off the. It means X on the. No, I should have still picked it up. I don't know why it's not picking this stuff up, which is weird. There we go. We go back to that stuff then. I don't know, it's, it's weird when it doesn't like completely pick it up. <laughs> Maybe it's because of my <laughs> the lag I'm going through. But this is, if you never play this game, this is a multi player game. There's about 100 people, sometimes less, I if, guess if the, if the whole slew of people doesn't come on here, but it'll do 100 up to 100 people. And I would assume this game would play a lot better if I was next to the router. The last game we played, the Sonic game, which was local, it was, it was, not, a, it was not an online game, but it was, uh, you can play it online, but I wasn't playing it online. That was playing completely fine. Yeah, I don't know why it won't let me pick up this stuff. <laughs> All right, guys, so we saw this game for a little bit, just running around, and I don't want to be playing this game for 30 minutes trying to find somebody, so, uh, but anyway, this is PUBG. All right, guys, so we are in Fortnite at this point, so um, this is the last game we'll check out, and I'm in the same, everything's the set, same setup. I think, you know, doing these long distance um, places in your house away from the router could be you know a little bit trying which is you know it's not it's not based off this particular Nvidia shield or the or the pro version you know being better they're both going to be equally the same in that regard it's that you know the game streaming itself needs to either be hardwired which is obviously going to be the best and most consistent um, or be really, really close to the router itself with no doors closed and literally probably right next to it at that point to just get, you know, much better performance out of this. But this game seems to be running. It's allowing me to pick up stuff a little bit easier, better than the uh, PUBG was. PUBG, I don't know, for some reason, was allowing me to pick up stuff when I was hitting X. It did one time, but then the other times it didn't. Obviously, they it looks the graphics don't look awful, but it looks like some of the details taken away a little bit. Especially when you look up at the trees and stuff, they don't look highly, highly detailed. But these actions are pretty smooth right here. Like, with swinging the ax. Ooh, search it. What do you got, what do you got, what do you got, what do you got? Ooh, ammo box. No, oh, I should run actually, huh? I don't play this game a ton. This is definitely playable. Definitely. If this is like your main, if you if you if you don't have the the money to get a you know a five hundred dollar to a thousand dollar PC or whatever to run this game, I know that you can play this game on your phone and other consoles consoles as well. But otherwise, it seems to be running pretty pretty good at this point. Um, the only difference I should say, and you can probably tell, is that I did open the door to my office. <clears throat> but there's still a door closed that leads to my router, so that, that could be a, the, the reason for a slightly better performance. But the router's still pretty far away, you know, 50, 50 feet away or so, 40, 50 feet away. There's someone right there. Stick with me. Let's try to get him. It looked like someone was there. Or maybe that's just fish. I haven't played this updated version of Fortnite. Yeah, it's just waves. All right, guys, there you go. That is GE Force now. They have tons of games to, to, to stream and, and play and um, just enjoy. You know, these games are coming from the Steam library and they've got a lot of big games, uh, some free to play. So if you don't want to spend any money, but you just want to try out the service, you get all these free to play games. Some of them are multiplayer games. You got game, games for kids. You have games if you don't have the gaming controller there's games you can play with just the the media remote that comes with the system there's action games 
And some of these are AAA titles as well. I mean, you're going to see some older games and, and newer games at the same time. It's not, you know, just all crappy games. There are some cool games thrown in the mix. So there you guys go. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Um, like I said, I will do another video where I'm closer to the router just to see how much performance improves over this. Thanks for watching. See you guys down the road. Peace.